The broadcast is now starting. All attendees are in listen-only mode. Hello, everybody, and welcome to this webinar on how you can win loyalty, more repeat purchases, and faster inventory turn with Opculture Marketing Tools for Retail Pro. Uh, my name is Uliana Evatisov. I am part of the team at, at Retail Pro, and it's my pleasure to introduce to you guys today the Opculture Marketing um, team and, and the product today. Um, it's available for Retail Pro Prism as well as le legacy versions of Retail Pro. And actually, a lot, many, many retailers, um, Retail Pro retailers worldwide are already using this tool to, uh, to build promotions to move their inventory faster and also to reward people you know, for shopping with them, whether they're shopping in store, online, or, or both. Um, in today's webinar, you'll also get to hear about some some pretty cool new features actually that Opculture has recently added that um, they one gives you a way to programmatically incentivize customers to make more repeat visits um, and another new functionality um, helps you use your retail pro data to build data driven campaigns you've already got really solid good data in there right so let's let's put it to good use um, so excited to get to share that with you Benji. Um, Benji of the Opculture team, he is the Director of Operations there, and he will be your host today for that. So without further ado, Benji, if you please. All right. Thanks for that wonderful introduction, Uliana. And uh, thank you all for taking the time to join us today for this exciting webinar about Opculture and how we can help your business. So let's start with a little bit of background on Opculture and how we currently help our clients. <clears throat> so who is Opculture and what do we do? Well, Opculture started off a long time ago as just an email service provider. But over the years, we have evolved into a powerful platform that handles all aspects of loyalty and marketing. So with all of your tools and data in one location, Opculture users have a high level overview of marketing operations. Our areas of expertise include email and SMS campaigns, creating custom promotions on products or receipt totals, and sending your customers branded electronic receipts. Opticulture is also a fully functioning loyalty platform where users can create custom programs such as points per dollar programs or cashback loyalty programs. These feature automated communication for rewards as well as customer portals for checking loyalty progress and transaction and even the ability to create frequent buyer programs. So how does this help you? Well, do you know your customers? When it comes to retail business, customer engagement is the key to success. With the set of tools Opculture provides, we help you engage with your customers from the very first visit. Right away, users of Opculture have the ability to create relevant groups for all of their customers based on profile, purchase, or interaction attributes. So know your customers, know what they are buying, know how much they are spending, and know how often they are shopping with you. We're gonna go now into the actual Opculture portal itself and take a look at the dashboard here. So in the Opculture dashboard view, you can get a feel for everything that's happening in your store and see the communications that are going out to your customers. The seven most recent campaigns that are sent out are displayed here on the right. You can also see customers that have opted in to receive communications, how many customers have opted out or unsubscribed, as well as quickly navigate to other parts of the application itself, such as creating email and SMS campaigns, checking reports for those campaigns, uploading lists or creating segments, as well as even viewing loyalty reports for your program. The opt Intel dashboard gives us a quick overview of sales, the number of visits from new and returning customers, revenue from discounts, as well as the number of discount codes redeemed. Over here on the right, the dashboard displays trends for a selected period of time. You can see highest revenue day, the most frequently purchased product, and the top selling store for that period. So, So how does it all work? Well, what if your marketing and sales team could create a roadmap for the entire year of operations? With Opculture, you can do just that. 
we take up to three years of past data from Retail Pro so new OpCulture users can look at sales for certain seasons, which products were popular among customers, and which customers are spending the most with your business. So get together with your team. Look at what you are already doing season by season. Segment out the customers that made purchases in those seasons. Look at the purchase behavior leading up to and following major holidays. Finally, use all of this information to advertise appropriate products to your customer base and to create drip campaigns for big ticket or special care items. Let's take a look here at what we've done for one of our customers. This customer is a bike retail store here in Houston, Texas with multiple locations. And whenever a customer purchases a bicycle, they immediately start receiving communication and promotions based on the type of bike that was purchased. If it is a mountain bike, the customer would receive information about where to ride, how to care for their bike, and customized offers on accompanying products. When a customer purchases a road bike, they are started on a drip campaign relevant to road cycling, popular cycling routes, when groups of riders are meetings, races or official events for cyclists, and of course, accompanying products and offers that are relevant to road cycling. This business even runs a similar drip campaign for people who purchased kids' bikes. These drip style campaigns were set up to run at intervals based on when the purchase was made and what type of bike was purchased. These campaigns did not have to be edited or scheduled again unless the business wanted to make a change. So with this high level of customer engagement, repeat purchases and referrals are a real source of revenue generation for this bike retailer. So how can we help you? Well, here are some other ways OpCulture benefits our clients. Replenishment campaigns. So most items don't last forever, need to be replaced at some point. What items are being sold at your store that meet that criteria? How long between purchases of that item? Set up a recurring campaign to customers who purchase those items and let them know it's time for a replacement or a refill. Does your customer uh, does your store sell any special care items or items that have accompanying warranties? You can set up automated communication for these products and never have to worry about taking calls or individual questions about these items again. Finally, mobile applications branded for your company. Yes, you heard that right. You, with OpCulture, you can create your own app on Google Play or the App Store and give your customers the ability to register for rewards, see their past purchases, their loyalty program progress, and receive push notifications for events and personalized offers. Let's take a closer look at that mobile application. So our mobile application allows users to register for loyalty and create customer profiles. The app is branded with your store logos and colors. We also use your logos to create icons and headers. Customers can find your app in the Google Play Store for Android users and the App Store for Apple users. Through the mobile application, businesses can collect valuable profile information for marketing purposes, and you can provide customers with an interactive loyalty portal. This is also a great way to cut down the wait times at the point of sale. Customers can enroll in the loyalty program from their phone, and by the time they're ready to check out, their profile is in Retail Pro, saving data entry time for the store associate. So why should you do all this? Well, with retail customers receiving more marketing communications than ever before, unsubscribe rates are also higher than ever before. Simply put, people are not fond of receiving advertisements for products they are not interested in. Typical open rates for marketing emails are often 15 to 30 percent. After using OpCulture and creating relevant customer communications, we have seen those open rates routinely double or even triple in some cases. With OpCulture, you're actually getting to know your customers. So what questions do you have about your market base and what data can you gather to answer them? Let's talk a little bit about our integration with uh, e-commerce. Does your business have an online store? Uh, you know, loyalty programs, they're a great tool for retail businesses to help engage existing customers and increase the number of repeat visits. But what about those customers who make their first purchases online? What about your customers that only shop online? 
do your customers have the ability to earn rewards for online purchases? Can those customers redeem rewards and promotions online? With OpCulture, we can integrate into your e-commerce platform and customers can use those rewards earned in store as well as earn rewards for those online purchases. As a customer of your business, I could make my first purchase online, my second purchase could be in store, and upon checkout, I'll already have a profile in Retail Pro and rewards to use. Let's say it's vice versa. I make my first purchase in store and my second purchase online. I'll have the same seamless experience. Upon entering my information, my profile can be seen and the rewards I've earned are eligible for redemption online. So what does this do for your business? <clears throat> well, with an integrated e-commerce solution, OpCulture provides a clear path to engagement for all customers, whether they're in-store or online shoppers. One-time customers, those that only make one purchase, can sometimes make up to 20 and even 30% of a total customer base. With OpCulture, when a customer makes their first purchase with your business, they can automatically start receiving relevant marketing information in a drip style campaign format. Engage with your customers in order to incentivize repeat visits and develop customers who will visit your store for years to come. Let's look at our e-commerce integration from a customer's uh, point of view. On the right here, you'll see the widget for our Shopify integration. After logging in, displayed on the widget are the rewards the shopper has available. In the redeemable balance box, the customer can enter the amount they would like to redeem on that purchase. The details of the purchase and the discount will be displayed on the checkout page. Just like our regular loyalty program with online rewards, Retailers can limit online redemptions to a certain dollar amount, and you can also exclude discounted items or certain products from earning rewards online. So what's the process from the associate point of view? Let's say a customer has made a purchase and enrolled in the loyalty program through your e-commerce site. The customer then comes into the physical store looking to make a purchase and redeem the rewards. The associate simply clicks to search for a customer, the OpCulture CRM feature will appear. Next, the associate enters the customer information, selects the correct customer, and the customer will be added to the receipt as well as the Retail Pro database. So this truly makes OpCulture a full circle retail solution. Let's talk a little bit about some of the uh, program enhancements we've had for our loyalty program. OpCulture has created what we call a perks program. A perks program would allow OpCulture users to create a loyalty tier of customers who automatically receive a certain amount of rewards for a specified time period. At the end of the time period, the issued rewards expire. For instance, you could give your highest spending customers $20 in rewards to use each month. At the end of the month, unused rewards expire and are refilled the following month. In essence, you're creating a member tier which will incentivize customers to visit within a certain period of time. This could also be uh, useful if you provide your employees with a discount. A perk style program would allow you to give employees a specific amount of rewards to use within a time frame and a platform to manage those rewards. Let's take a look at the loyalty portal in the application itself. I'm gonna go ahead and navigate to the loyalty tab here and select loyalty programs. and clicking the envelope icon allows me to edit. You can see here under the program configuration, I've got things like enrollment rec requisites, which can allow your business to require that certain information be collected when signing up. Your business can also, as mentioned earlier, limit redemption amounts as well. On step two, when configuring earning and redeeming rules, you can create privilege tiers and bonuses based on lifetime purchase amount and create programs like our perks program, which can provide customers with a set amount of rewards for a chosen time period. So how should you use this feature? Well, through our segmentation tool, go ahead and determine how many customers have spent over a certain amount or have made a certain number of purchases. For example, how many customers have spent more than $500 with your business? How many customers have spent more than 1,000? 
look at the numbers and decide what works best for you. You could also charge customers a small monthly fee to enroll in this tier. Think of it as subscribing to a VIP service. Customers pay a small fee for monthly discounts and preferential treatment. Once your team has made a decision on a, how to proceed with this program, create a tier for these customers. By giving this customer base rewards, you are incentivizing them to make more purchases. The customer has to make a purchase within the specified time period, otherwise rewards are lost. If this group typically spends more than the average customer, you can expect to see more revenue generated based on these repeat visits. And just like our regular loyalty program with OpCulture, the OpCulture Perks program allows for customers to receive automated communication for when rewards are available or even when rewards are expiring. This is all configurable by the user within the application, allowing for customization of scheduled uh, campaigns. We all know communication is absolutely paramount in getting your customers excited about loyalty programs, redeeming rewards, and redeeming offers. So with that being said, I'd like to thank you all again for your time today. With the holiday season coming up and just around the corner, there's no better time to get started with op culture. Let us help you use all of that valuable Retail Pro data that's being collected at the time of sale, and let's get your e-commerce site integrated for seamless customer experience. So reach out to us for a more in-depth demonstration of features and for more information on how we can customize our solution to fit your needs. Thank you all. Appreciate it. Yeah, thank you, Benji. Thank you um, for the for the update on these new features. I think it's actually um, the Perks program could actually do quite a lot. I feel as far as getting repeat purchases in there, right? And and this last point you brought up about the communication and SMS messages, just you know, from a marketing standpoint on our side here, just it's kind of industry standard. You know that email um, email messages from a company get you know. 15, 20% open rates, let's say, if you've got email message from a human being rather than a company name, that jumps to like 60%. And the same is true also um, with communication means like email versus SMS, right? Everybody's got their phone on them all the time. They might not check their email on their um, on their on their phone as often, but SMSs, like text messages, people check that all the time. We know that at the dinner table, right? So um, so yeah, so yeah. It's, it's actually really cool to see um, the kind of features that you guys have available for retailers and just being a part of of a customer's day in that way right and sending the sms's and and just keeping them wrapped into your brand and keeping them um thinking about your brand and opportunities to you know that you give them with these cool perks programs to shop with that and then just you know as as you brought up with the retail pro data there's so much that data like that's being collected that um, really kind of goes idle a lot of times because maybe, you know, maybe people don't have the tools to apply that data, right, to from the insights that they can glean from it. But OptiCulture really um, makes a way for, for you to be able to apply that data and, and use it um, to just increase sales in that way. So that's really cool. So thank you, Benji, for, for sharing all of that with us today. Um, I think, you know, if anybody has, has questions, please feel free um, to email Benji at this uh, at this, at the information here, um, and then we will be posting. Um, we will be posting the recording of this webinar uh, to the My Retail Pro portal um, for for you guys to be able to view, and and we'll send that over to you guys as well, of course. So so please do contact um, Benji. Feel free, um, and uh, with any questions that you might have after the event, and um, we'll give you a, a few minutes back for for your day. And thank you all so much for joining us. So thank you, Benji. Thank you, everybody else, and and. Um, uh, hope to hear from you soon on that. Alrighty. Thank you, Liana, and I appreciate you guys all taking the time to join us today. Alrighty, ta-ta.